Hi, in today's tutorial, I will be creating an executable graphical user interface Python program to calculate body mass index or BMI. So I'm using a Python 3.8 uh, installed on my Windows 10 and also I'm using the Visual Studio Code application to write my Python code. Um, I'm going to use Py Uninstaller. Uh, so the Py Uninstaller bundles a Python application and all its dependencies into a single executable package. So we are using the Py Uninstaller to convert the Python file into .exe file. In order to install the Py Uninstaller, open the command prompt on your Windows 10 and type in pip install py uninstaller. Make sure that the pip is already uh, installed on your machine. Also, in order to create the graphical user interface, we are going to use the GUI toolkit, uh, which is tkinter. So the tkinter module is a Python module that creates the GUI interface for our Python program. So here I'm on my desktop. Uh, I do have Python scripts uh, folder. Let me open this folder and create the Python file here. So new and uh, I'm selecting text documents. I'm going to change the file type to py to make it Python. And I'm going to uh, type in bmi-calculator. and dot uh, p y so click on yes so this is my uh, python uh, file that i'm going to type in the code with so click on open with uh, visual studio code
So now we can uh, test the code, uh, run this code, and we see the GUI. Uh, this is the graphical user interface. Uh, we also see the title, uh, BMI calculator. Uh, we see the text boxes and we see here calculate uh, the BMI. Uh, we see the results. Uh, your BMI is and you are categorized as. So if we enter the uh, value such as uh, enter your weight in kilogram. So 70 enter your height in meter so 1.75 1. and then hit the button here uh, calculate BMI and you see it's a 22.85 and it also provide you with the category so you are categorized as normal so your uh, body mass index indicate that the person is within the normal uh, or the healthy weight uh, if we go to let's say if we go to uh, 40 uh, kilogram and within the same height uh, and hit on cal calculate BMI uh, you see the category will change to underweight which is unhealthy and also if we go uh, far like 100 kilogram uh, calculate BMI we see it's 32.65 uh, BMI um, and obviously for body mass index uh, above 30 is considered to be obese also we did um, add in our code the exception uh, or the error handling uh, within the zero so if we type in here uh, zero so this is the height and let's say we give weight and uh, click on calculate uh, BMI you would see something like none so this is the error handling uh, within Python so finally I want to convert this Python file into an executable .exe file uh, in order to do that we are going to use the uh, py installer um, from the command prompt so open your command prompt here and make sure uh, to change your directory into the same uh, location of your Python script. So if you go to the Python th script here, right click, copy address, going back to the command prompt and paste here. So I have the location now and the command CD. So here I'm inside the Python scripts uh, folder. Now I'm going to type in pi installer space double dash one file then the name of my python file so bmi dash calculator dot pi so as you see now it's the pi installer now in the process of creating my um, executable file. So here it says uh, building exe completed successfully. Uh, close the command prompt and go to the distribution folder here. This, these are the folder that I created. Uh, so we see the distribution idea version here. And as you see here, this is the executable uh, file. So double click here. And here we go. It's my executable uh, file is successfully running. Um, so this is my uh, BMI calculator. We can test. And here we go. So we can also check the file type. Um, click, uh, select the application, right click, properties, and as you see, it's an uh, application. .exe uh, application. 
click on OK. That's it for this tutorial. I will leave in the description a uh, link to uninstall Python if you want Visual Studio Code. Also, like the code, uh, I'm going to upload this code on my GitHub account so you can uh, download and test on your um, machine. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Thank you so much for watching and talk to you later. Bye.